Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Come on, quit lollygagging and go to Seventh Heaven already. Searching for candidates. Is that who Wedge mentioned? Merchant? That sword's massive. What does he sell again? If you don't want to get hurt, keep your distance. That sword's massive. What does Searching for candidates. Merchant? Stay focused. Everybody does. We keep putting off maintenance. anything funny or you'll get it. The kids seem to think you're pretty cool. Not a lot of options when it comes to figures. Hmm. Looking good. Quality of product makes a huge difference. Just like Jump on that empty room at Stargazer Heights. The vacant lot up ahead is overrun with wild beasts. Best steer clear unless you're looking for trouble. Even if you are, be careful. Let's 
I was at the Honey Bee Inn, and I met this incredible woman of my dreams. Huh? Hey, man, check it out. This song's pretty sweet, ain't it? You like it? You feeling it? Have a copy. Still rocking out to that song I gave you, bro? Danger. Falling debris. Keep out. Not going that way. Some folks use the lot for meetups. Seedy types who like their privacy and don't take kindly to interruptions. You ever take a... Hello there. You must be that friend of Tifa's I've heard so much about. The mercenary? I've got fingers in a few pies myself. Worked with a lot of businesses. Even Seventh Heaven, on occasion. <laughs> what I'm saying is, you and me, we're not so different. And certainly not complete strangers. In fact, I want you to think of me as family. You know, an uncle or maybe a distant relative. Oh, while I have you here, you wouldn't happen to be interested in grappling guns, would you? Great for getting up or down in a jiffy. I ordered some for a client, but I accidentally added a zero, and now I have a ton to spare. Was thinking of setting up an attraction where you jump from the top of the Shinra building. You know, for the adrenaline junkies. But the fellas at Shinra didn't think it was such a great idea. <laughs> Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jesse put her mind to it. <sighs> Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. <sighs> we bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? <sighs> Please? <sighs> well, let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go 
go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. Everyone's worried. Barrett's out making his rounds too. As long as I get it all today. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to. Wait. Who is it? Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. For your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look? Thanks. If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teep is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. What you see is what we got. All the items you could want, straight from the place. He's a regular. Stock up here, and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady is a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Imagine if rich people start thinking it's safer down here than on the plate. Apparently it was done by a Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Oh. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa! My dear, dear girl! Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit. Big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Don't you still have work to do? Well, go on then. Get back to it. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been here a while now? Five years, give or take. Absolutely. But never mind that. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapons store. Folks who are tops out are losing pay by the day. Hey, but isn't Tifa? You here for the filter? Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! Alright. If you could just settle your bill, 
We'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barra be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the neighborhood watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. No better way to keep you and your family safe? I wonder. If there's any way they can Come make our check job. check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh... Lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in Gil, but we'll work something out. No turning back. Bring it. Best is right. Get ready. It's on now.
lost yourself. Focus. Drag it out. No need to be, really. Took care of the dog, did you? Phew. We owe you one. Gotta say, I've never seen a Shinra breed like that before. Out of curiosity, when exactly did it show up? Oh, today. The first reports came in just this morning. Uh, why do you ask? Wait a minute. There's this crazy story about a Shinra research lab hidden right beneath our feet under the slums. Huh. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> and here I thought you might know something I don't. Well, I guess not. It's a big organization. I'm sure there's lots of secrets I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. You got the bastard. That's good enough for me. Okay, then. That's another solid gig in the books. You know, the whole town is really impressed with what you've done. Keep it up, and you'll have enough work to keep you fed for a lifetime. Well, thanks to you. And don't you forget it. So where do we get paid? The shop or something? Yeah, 
But why don't we head back to the apartments first? Take a quick breather. Which lesson was that again? Lesson one. Got it? Anyway, let's go. Thank you. That hound had us scared half of that. I can sleep easy when I get around. The watch is saying they're gonna step off their game. Huh? Someone's back awful early. Not that I mind. Would you two be dears and swap your filters out for me? I left them in your rooms. Sure thing. Not so fast, you. Do me a favor. She needs a friend. A real friend. We're already friends. So when she talks, are you really listening? Thinking about her and her feelings? Or are you just going through the motions? Go on. Let's take care of this real quick, okay? Sure. Come over when you're done. One sec. I'll be done in a bit. Finally. <clears throat> so, after you left the village, mm -hmm. I let you off the hook before, back at the hall, but not this time. Uh. Uh. Hmm? Well, when we were kids, everybody wanted to be a soldier, right? Yeah, I remember they were on the news every day during the war. Thing is, by the time I finally made it in, they didn't need heroes anymore. It was nothing like what we dreamt of. It was just working for Shinra. Just... I'm sorry. I know it's a touchy subject. Oh. Not exactly small talk. Especially with someone you haven't seen in a while. I get it. Still, it's kind of funny. Us going our separate ways, thinking that must be it. That we'd never meet again. And then here of all places we do. You know what? We should totally celebrate. Let's dress up and hit the town. Really? I mean, why not? It'll be fun. Do you even have fancy clothes? Not like fancy fancy, but I'll figure something out. What do you think would suit me, huh? Something exotic? Uh, really? 
Then again, if we're making an effort... Be sure to pick an outfit that goes with mine, okay? <laughs> Will do. Oh boy. <clears throat> <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. You'll see. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> and on that happy note, I think it's time we head back to the bar. Come on. Uh, you don't need a break? Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Marl isn't always right, you know. So we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. Uh, I don't feel that different. Must be my imagination then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Merc. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her. You'll get no second chances from me. They blew up a reactor so they could see. I wish I had your strength and confidence. And here we are. You must be tired. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. So, what'll it be? Wanna head back out for a little while? Yeah, why not? Pretty sure I've done everything already. It can be done around here. Well, you want to head inside? Fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay... You'll get your money. 
So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. I'm really sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime... <gasps> Grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> People would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. I gotta go. Uh, enjoy. Huh? Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings. So if it comes down to do or die... If I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then... I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time.
Maybe just chill a bit.
What was up with that girl anyway? I heard you're having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. I just... I feel trapped. If it feels wrong, don't do it. <sighs> Guess that's that then. What, they kick you out? We agreed to disagree. So, you want another drink? Tifa! Time to celebrate. Break out all the good stuff. Oh, sure. <clears throat> we won't be needing you for this next job. Feel free to look for work elsewhere. Fine by me. That's how I like it. No contract, no obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This is a private affair. <sighs> Sorry, I tried. We talked it over, but in the end... We didn't want to put so much on you. This is our fight. Jesse, what's the holdup? Be right there. No hard feelings, huh? It's fine. Let's talk more after I'm done here, okay? Really, it's fine. Come on, Jesse, I'm dying here. I'll catch you later. Sorry to keep you thirsty boys waiting. be about to ask for more money okay what were we talking about keep it tight ain't no room for erica we'll talk so where'd we leave off more reason to live it up now yep let me treat you to dinner at my place i can introduce you to all my cats uh where were we it's been too long since we did this could get pretty dicey out there oh, my bad continue not since we went on that all-night bender after HQ gave us the boot. They did not give us the boot. It was an amicable separation. Uh, just... I'd offer to share, but... You know. Uh... Where were we? I can't believe it's all... Bet you could use a bite to eat, too, huh? Uh... Where were we? Well, I do. Can't expect anyone but a true believer to stand tall if everything goes sideways. Oh, my bad. Continue. No need for that, boss. We all knew what we were signing up for. Yeah, but when shit hits the fan, it's good to know you in my corner. At the end of the day, you're all I got. <laughs> 
Happy to look out for you, like I know you'll look out for me. So long as someone looks out for my stomach. Tifa's got you covered there. As a friend, or as a cook. As if you've really got to ask. <laughs> hey, right? little guy. You need anything? <laughs> oh, <laughs> that tickles! <laughs> I guess it is kind of obvious. <laughs> you know, it'd be really cool if we could do this again tomorrow night. Oh, we will. Avalanche! Avalanche! <laughs> <laughs> you heard him. It's on for Why sure. Why not every night? <laughs> <laughs> you guys. <laughs> we'll talk later. I promise. So what? Now you give a shit about the cause? We were all pushing real hard for you, you know? What's up with them? Where it is, he lives in this town. Just shut up and wait. So we'll find him soon enough. Man. Seems like the <sighs> Hey brother, you from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm? Pretty set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch, do you? Five hundred. Two hundred. Mm, three. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Hey. Got something to say? What? You looking at me? These assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on Wall Market. All right. Don't know. Word of advice, Blondie. Don't boss, piss off my friend here. Man. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> After you, brother. But don't worry. I ain't the backstabbing type. Most days. Spill it! You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. If they weren't Shinra, then... Not my problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. Uh, not bad. Huh? 
seen them around here. Are you gonna let me in, so we can talk in private? Guess I'll get right to the point then. Huh, what have you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh. Or not, what do you think it is? A proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight. You and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now... It's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Mm. Oh. A down payment. Damn. 